Assalamu alaikum. I am reading a BBC important report. Please listen to it. Thousands of flights in US grounded due to IT outrage. Major airlines have restored some operations after grounding flights across the US, citing communication issues caused by a global IT outrage. The outrage, which has also affected banks and emergency services around the world, has been caused by a faulty software update from cyber security firm Crowd Strike. Delta Airlines, which is the world's second biggest carrier by passenger numbers, had passed all of its flights but later said some had resumed. American Airlines also grounded its flights earlier but has resumed service. CrowdStrike has apologized and said that the issue has been identified, isolated and a fix has been deployed. It is not currently known when the issue will be resolved. It is also said in the BBC report more than 1,300 flights have been cancelled around the world. What a surprise! It's not known actually what has happened. That is what the BBC report says. Even in Tamil, Urdu and other magazines, this report has been given prominence and it has caused very much trouble to the business world. It is hoped that everything will be all right within a day or two. Let us wait and see. Thank you for your listening. Yes, what do you think about this failure? Which it seems is unprecedented. And we do not remember whether such a failure has happened in the near past. There was no report about the failure when flights were delayed, but later reports poured in and people came to know what has happened. It is also said nearly 28,000 flights have been delayed and more than 3,000 have been cancelled according to flightware. American Airlines and Delta have told passengers they would be issuing travel waivers for the disrupted services. Around the world, thousands of travelers have been affected. U.S. tourist Stephanie Thompson was unable to board her flight back to Dallas following a holiday in the U.K. We couldn't get an answer from anybody, she said, speaking from Edinburgh Airport. I was on hold with 
American Airlines for about an hour and 10 minutes before I finally hung up. We just paid $6,800 for a one-way trip home, hopefully living tonight. I didn't know what else to do. I just wanted something to get us home. A spokeswoman for Los Angeles International Airport told the BBC that some flights are taking off and landing, including that the issue is primarily affecting airlines rather than airports. United Airlines has also been affected by the tech outrage along with a number of smaller carriers. The first indication of the crowd strike issue affecting USA 